Hey guys, this is Comic Kuno, and I am here with Mimi once again, Hi. where we talk. The, last time we did Team Wolf. Yes. This time we're doing Arrow. Oh, uh, so yeah, we're gonna talk about this episode. I've been totally excited to watch. It's Birds of Prey episode. Um, so in this episode, we get to see Huntress wants revenge on her father again. Look again. Um, stick it to your cause. Yeah, stick, stick it to your cause. So you're not like, eh, I want to get rid of Oliver. Now just. Thank God. It was all like, I'm going to get rid of Oliver because he's redone the Black Canary. Now it's mm -hmm. all like, I still hate my dad and I'm on the die. There's no romance, which There's is no good. Romance, which there is, is good. And Black Canary doesn't feel threatened at no, all, which is no, great. Which and is that would be annoying if she did. Minus the slight jealousy gun, but that was funny. Yeah, that was good. But that, yeah. It was a good con. It wasn't all yeah. like, what? Yeah, Someone it was just else? like, oh, ex girlfriend? Okay, okay, I get you it. Gotta like, you gotta I have Nissa, you know, you out. I got no need, nothing to say here. Yeah, so, um,. Yeah, so also we could see Roy, he breaks up with Thea, um, and now Roy's and getting angry. Him too. Yeah, because Oliver, you know, because he's so great with relationships. He's so good, he's such a good role model for relationships. <laughs> I mean, Mr. I'm not with both sisters. Yeah, so Roy is now upset about this, and so. you could tell, and now Thea, um, she's totally upset. She's, she's going down the tubes also. Uh, yeah, and she goes in the car. She goes in the car. There yeah. was a tweet like, don't go in the car. And we were like, what car? What car? What car? And then we're like, where's the car? Where's the car? Yeah. There's the car. There's the car. There's the car. The car. in the end, which is crazy, which we will talk about. We're just referencing what happened in the story, and then we'll talk about favorites and stuff and everything. Um, and also we get to see Laurel, kind of likable here. She's good. Like she that. returns as a lawyer, pretty much. Okay, like, like And that. she's in the story um, with the Hunter stuff. She's held captive. Yeah. So we get to see her in action and a little bit more. Not that I don't like her. I just didn't like what was going on. I knew they were going to do something with her, mm -hmm. obviously. Yeah, she's destined to be Black Canary. Destined to be Black Canary, but I wasn't so... But it was... It wasn't I don't like I her that much. It wasn't that I didn't like her. It was hitting an emotional note because of how well the acting was, mm -hmm. in my opinion, for her alcoholism, drug abuse. Like, that was why I didn't like her. I not think, her. It was just... For me, it was kind of her. Yeah. So, for me, uh, it was just you. like, oh, God, that hits so many mm -hmm. emotions. I, I watched a lot of people on Tumblr. I watched people on Tumblr. I saw a lot of people on Tumblr and Twitter saying, like, it wasn't even that they didn't like Laurel. They just, mm -hmm. it was, they did a really good job. It was striking a lot yeah. of, like. I think it, we were supposed to hate the character yeah. at that moment. And now, like, she's not my favorite character. Yeah, she's still, still my, favorite, my She's just... still my least favorite character of the show. Yeah. But I don't hate her as much. Yeah, I don't hate her. I just yeah. don't, like her all the time. Yeah. I like her darkness thing that was going on in this like episode. And I want to talk about Sour Laurel. Yes. Um, really like the Black Canary moments, because I feel Laurel knows she's Black Canary, but, but she doesn't say anything. Yet. Yeah, because she's like, oh, what what did you tell me? So I feel like she does know. Like, she's dropping hints, and, and Sarah, Sarah they're like, Shh, I'm busy fighting stuff. What? <laughs> what? Oh, 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 you know. Oh. Yeah. I think it'll happen by the end of and, season. End of season, totally. Um, it would, I think it's the same thing with Detective Lance. Like, Detective Lance knows, knows it's Oliver, Oliver. He but won't say Oliver. anything. Yeah. So I think it's really the reverse How do you that. not? Yeah, I think point, he knows that At this point. point, this random hero is saving my daughter. And the phone call, which I and love the, the Felicity call. line. <laughs> it's like, oh, it's I, my, it's my mom. It's my mom. No, it isn't. No, it isn't. And I love the Felicity line where she says that, yeah, I actually lose track of everyone that knows now. Yeah. Which I, I think the audience feels the same way. Also want to mention a couple of refer uh, references, the Gal Simone reference, which is great. It's like she's on Gal and Simone. Thought that was perfect because Gail Simone does Birds of Prey. Mm -hmm. Now, actually talking about Birds of Prey, I thought it was, I don't think that it should have been titled Birds of Prey. They should have saved that. Maybe it will come back to haunt us and we'll find out why. I mean, no, obviously they're Huntress, the Birds of Prey in the comics is Huntress, Black Mary, Oracle. Oracle could either be Felicity, but they kind of use Laurel in this episode. Okay. Um, but they weren't really teammates, so I feel like they could have called it something else that alluded to Birds of Prey, mm -hmm. but not use Birds of Prey right away, because I didn't feel like this was a Birds of Prey episode, so I was a little disappointed with that. Um, that was really one of my only disappointments. Um, it was good. There was a lot of cool moments. Um, oh, is it my favorite episode? I don't know. I don't know if it's my favorite. I feel like I'm more hyped up watching it with you. <laughs> Cause, but like, I also feel like it was a very good. Last week's was. I good. shout out the TV, so that's probably why. <laughs> it's okay, I do too. Last week's was good. This one was way better. Yeah, yeah. Last week. I know was this one's okay. definitely in my top five for the season. Yeah, definitely. I think um, it might be five, and then the other ones will be higher up. I agree. Um, I think Air of the Demons still my favorite of the season. The that's the one Nissa was in. Yes, that that's one. still my favorite, and I, I think a lot of the beginning Black Canary episodes were my that favorite. That one, I think her, I think her, she was her was her, her episode was like episode three. Yeah, I was around episode three, and also to mention about the Birds of Prey thing, Birds of Prey means girl power, and yeah. it wasn't so much girl. I mean, it, it was, was girl power, great. but it was still Oliver and everyone else that was Which in it. I wanted a full fine, girl but power. I do want, I think maybe we'll get that one next week, mm -hmm. possibly. Well, maybe not now. Not next week. No, probably not next not week. Not next week. But, but I we're probably going to get that one. Yeah. I would say, and then I mean, we'll get that. 
Yeah, I'm excited to see how this plays out. I yeah. want that girl power, not just because I'm female, but because of the writing. Like, you know they want to do it, and you know they're getting yeah, there. Yeah, it's alluding to it. Yeah, they're, and they're really good they with are, power They are very good show. at it. Um, they're not, like, we have Black Canary as our lead. Like, yeah. And we still Felicity is the brainy girl power. And Which like, I was actually disappointed how they didn't use a, Felicity that much in this episode. episode. Like, we got her, she got some good moments, but it wasn't mm-hmm. enough. And she's alluded to Oracle throughout the series, and Oracle is the bird's prey. So it was really strange that they didn't even reference that. Um, so I was a little disappointed with that. Um, but let's talk about Thea because I feel like that's what really, um, for me, I'm a big Thea fan just because I'm a big Mia Dearden fan and I'm going to give out a shout out to Jeremy because we're both big Mia Dearden fans. Um, so I feel I wanted a little bit more with Thea and they're finally utilizing that towards the end of the season. And, um, we'll also talk about the speedy thing. Um, but with Thea, I really like the ending and I, I think we, sh- she will find out the truth with Slade and... She might team up with Slade in the end. Yeah, because I feel like she can't trust her family. And once she finds she, out Oliver she can't trust, yeah, that's she can't gonna trust her, anybody. That's going to make her go with Slade. But then, Slade, somehow. and I think Slade can actually te- keep or, Thea as a mentor. And maybe Merlin somehow. That's going yeah. to that's gonna bite Edward in the ass. I think Thea... I, Merlin, we haven't had him since he came. Mm-hmm, but since he revealed... Since he revealed, like, hey, I'm her dog, I'm the dad. Yeah. Yeah, we haven't had him since. And I think um, with... I don't want this. <laughs> I'm the dad. Um, I think by the end of the season, we're definitely going to get, um, I think it'd be a perfect if they do the season finale of Thea turning evil, and then going to season three, her training throughout that break, and yeah. then coming back as evil, finding out Oliver is, or know, like, the finding, he'll, he'll be all like, by the way, your brother's the arrow, and then like, fade to black, like, mm-hmm. we'll get that, he'll I, be the one that, I, oh, Oh, that's gonna be so painful. Slade and I think it'll be next episode, honestly, because they already Mm -hmm. revealed that people are going to find out this season, and I think what makes Thea a good character is if she finds out, because she's so pushed to the background, which I've been talking about. Even in her core episode of this episode, she was pushed towards the background until the end. Yeah, that's gonna be ooh, that's gonna be painful. I think this Deathstroke episode is gonna be really good Thea episode, which is gonna be really good back to back when you Mm -hmm. think of it. Like this is gonna be okay right now, but then we see it compared to it's gonna be. Like, yeah, I think there. Deathstroke is going to be a really cool episode. And Birds of Prey, I'm going to give, uh, I don't know if I can get to the 4.5, but I'm, I, if I could give a 4.25, I would, but I guess I'm going to go with the 4.5. Or, yeah, I would give a 4.25. I know that's really weird. I can't give it a 4 because it's better than a solid episode, but I don't know if it made a 4.5 for me. Now I'm feeling weird. I feel like I was I was hyped in the moment, mm-hmm. but I'm still like hyped in the moment from Divergent Shopping. Yeah, so I'm which like, we'll have a review hyped. for. Yeah, I'm just hyped. All this girl power today. Oh, uh, all the girl uh, power. Yeah, female, uh, female. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Don't ask. Oh, um, but yeah, I think uh, um, this episode. I I think I was a little bit more hyped up for this episode um, than what I got, but it was still a really good episode. I can agree to that one. Um, yeah. I like that we got Roy back again. I like that we got... Yeah, and uh, there's some really good drama here. There's a lot of good parts of this episode as a whole. I... Uh, can we talk about the rest of it now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Talk about Huntress, it. ow. You want to kill your dad? Yeah, yeah, we'll talk about her. Huntress. Ow. <laughs> um, with Huntress, I really like that moment where... I, I guess something psychologically is like, oh my god, I want to kill my dad. It's just that that connection of like, I'm upset my dad died, not for my hands. It's a little yeah, weird. Yeah, I liked that though, just because it was all like, I was going to do that. Yeah. yeah. Huntress was a really improved character in this episode. Very much. I liked the yeah. acting a lot more. I loved her in like, the really, fight scenes. She was bad the first season. She was one. really bad. She was bad. I really did not like the Huntress. And I think... Is she my favorite character? No. If she ever returned again, I don't care, but I think she's much improved. Way more improved. I liked those scenes. It, it, it's better acting. She's done other stuff, I think. I didn't really yeah. know her a lot. Me either. I didn't like her Jacket. I didn't give a crap about Jacket. But that was her as a lead. This yeah, was a she's got more event. acting. She's experience. gotten more under her belt, therefore I think she's improved. Also, her fight scenes were better. Yeah. Um, but now that we know that, what's her face? Is there Yeah, yeah if you guys don't know, um... Katie Lotz does her own stunt series on uh, YouTube. She has a parkour video, and I, I showed that to Mimi today. I um, she like does, she actually does all those stunts, and I was really surprised. Uh, so, But you do see they focus on the battle scenes, the fight scenes with 
uh, oh, Katie they instead. They focus on her more. I've noticed that more in fights in general when you know someone's doing their own stunts. Like Stephen Amell and Stephen Katie. Amell, like, uh, uh, he always gets me. Like he always. Yeah. Now just because he's the lead actor, but like you, he, he does his own stunts. Shit. So I feel. I think. I feel like Colton. Colton, I think he's got he's a lot allowed to do stuff. more. He's allowed yeah. to do more. So uh, but he's also not even like he doesn't do like the tech action. He does. Yeah, I'm gonna throw you out of them. Yeah. Car. So like he so, still so, does yeah. some stuff. So you don't yeah. really have to do that much. I'm really looking forward to seeing what they do with Roy. I don't. I, by the end of the season, I think. Well, the thing is, they're doing this for Thea to go downhill. That's why yeah. Roy had to break up with her. Yeah. So I really like that um, she can't trust anybody. And that that's what that last scene felt to me. I can't trust anybody, and that's why I can go to Slate's side. Um, and that excites me so much. So um, please, uh, anything else to add? Or? Um, I, I wrote that uh, it was a tweet that I retweeted, but that um, Diggle and Felicity are just playing Monopoly the entire time while the shit's going on. <laughs> yes. uh, I like that. I like that little headcanon. I, um, because I they didn't. I loved. Um, there's some point where yeah. Um, uh, Black Canary says you think I should beat her up, and Felicity's like, yeah, like, and Diggle's like, and Diggle's like, <laughs> and Diggle's like <laughs> I mean, Dick had his a whole other episode last. So I do get it. Yeah, but like. I, I love that. Head nod, but like, they, yeah. That was awesome how they weren't utilized, but they. The speedy comment! Oh, we have to mention that! Okay, okay, so we went back. Um, we four hear. Times. Yeah, like four times, and our DVR screwed up because of that. Um, but we went back four times because Arrow, you know, Oliver called Roy Speedy. And, we, and my dad was watching with us. He's like, no, he said freeze! I'm like, like he, said no, he said Speedy! He said Speedy! And then we find out, and that's confirmed that he said Speedy because of Thea. I and love that Roy's connection. And then just like, um, don't call me Speedy. I thought you gave me a nickname. Don't call me Speedy. <laughs> that was perfect because they're both Speedies. They're referencing that. Yeah, me I happy. really that love was, that. They scene. dropped a lot of bombs like that in this mm -hmm. one, and that's why I think I feel really good about it. Yeah, there was some. Th this episode is definitely rewatchable for me. I really? probably will be rewatching this episode. Episode, uh, as we wait for death strokes. Uh, really excited for that. So, uh, yeah, so that's our thoughts. Find Slade or, or get Slade. That little tag. <laughs> Find Slade or, or get, get Slade. Slade. That was like the Revenge is Back and Revenge Year. I, have to, I can't wait until the extended trailer for that because we know we'll get some stuff. So I loved it. Um, yes, I thought she was going to find out about Merlin in this episode because I heard awesome. a rumor, but maybe that'll be next episode. Uh, maybe. I feel like by the end of this. Oh, he's gonna, next okay, episode is next her episode. episode. He's going to be all like, oh, by the way, so your dad isn't really your dad. Yeah. Like, I think everything's going to come out of this random hallway. And, yeah, and then your brother, by the way, your brother's and Roy, oh, and he and has like these powers that I have too, so. <laughs> Surprise. Uh, oh, yeah, I think you're blaming me for that. And oh, 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 and Sarah, and Sarah's black and Sarah. Yeah, so there you hey. go. Thea. Now you know everything. Now, now you're forgiven you that now. you're not in you any episode. Now. You can go home now. <laughs> now that I've just dropped all these bombs on you. Oh, and you might want to be speedy and wear a dark suit because you're going to be evil. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, because she actually does have two suits. She has a red and yellow suit, a black and yellow suit. Black so and black yellow. and yellow, we got evil. Black then she goes in <laughs> black and yellow. <laughs> and then she goes into good... She'll be red and yellow. Yeah. I, I have this all trained in my thought. Like, uh, I, I know what I want for Thea, okay? Okay. Um, So that's all our thoughts on uh, Birds of Prey. It's a little bit of a longish one, but it's a discussion. Episode 17. Yes. 18, 17, so yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please tell us in the comments below what you thought. Expectations for the next episode. Thank God there's no break like the other CW shows. I was worried. I was so worried. I was like, they're all live tweeting cat. It's a sign. <laughs> and she's like, no, it's fine. It's, it's fine. Good. I'm like, it's no. Good. I think by after Deathstroke, we'll probably get a little bit break. I have a feeling. But we'll have to see. Um, mm -hmm. I'll look into like schedule stuff. But hope you guys enjoyed. We will see you guys later. Go check out Mimi's channel. We'll have it probably yeah, annotated yeah, somewhere. Yeah. yeah. I'm annotated, and uh, Mimi also does TV reviews, movie reviews, and check out our Divergent and Muppets review, which we'll have on uh, this video also. So, see you guys later. Bye.